guys, welcome back to the Abbey Dumbass Fishing YouTube channel. Today, me and my grandpa are going to be fishing this little creek for bullhead catfish. Um, we find it's the most prominent species in this little creek. It's a little fun thing to do, plus it's going to be like 95 degrees today. So as you can see, we're under some shade. And we're on this little bridge, it gets probably about 4 feet deep in here. My rig is just a split shot and a little piece of worm. If we were, our goal is to catch a shiner, which there's golden shiners in here. And when we catch them <coughs> and chop them up for a bait, that usually weeds out some of the pan fish in here. So I'm just gonna toss that guy in and set him up just like that on the little bridge. And hopefully we can get one. First fish of the day. <laughs> Didn't even realize I had him on a super tiny pan fish. That is the one trouble. That's why you need to get the shiners to use them for bait. If it gets too bad with the panfish, I might use a little guy like that for bait. Um, it is a green sunfish, so <laughs> I'm gonna release them. <laughs> yeah, there's so many guys. A lot of the little ones seem to be right against the bank. Yeah, I had another bite. Yeah, so I just sit down here and I hold my pole. There's one. One? Yep. Nice. Got my uh, hook a little bit. Okay guys, so I'm gonna drop him back in the water, get our pliers, and get this guy back swimming. Okay guys, so this little Sonny I just hooked, sadly, is not gonna make it. So I'm just gonna use him for bait. He'll work just as well. Same rig with the split shot. I just gotta tie on a small, small little number six octopus hook and i'll show you how i bait it up the second i get it in the water this will weed out a lot of the um a lot of the sunfish and it'll really get those catfish eaten so i'm just gonna tie it on with a little clinch knot and then we're gonna chop that guy up into small little steaks see if they like it a little chunk of meat Got some guts and blood in there. Circle hook. Just like that. Make sure no scales are on the top of the hook. It will really hurt your hookup ratio and your hook set. So we'll just toss that little guy in there and um, set it up just like that. And sooner or later, a fish comes around and we'll be ready to munch on it. Just like that. See, that's a catfish bite of 100%. So he's just running with it. Missed him. Dang, I can't, I'm struggling to hook him. Might have to put on a little. See, you guys, so I'm struggling to hook him. Means my bait's a little too big. I'm gonna chop off the whole gut pouch since it doesn't have any guts in it anymore. Retake my hook. Put it right through like that. Let's see, the meat can usually get them. The gut pouch, if you don't know where the fish are, the gut pouch is important, but the meat usually gets them. Now I'm just gonna hold my roll, pull and wait. Guys, my, my grandpa got a bit, nice sized bullhead. Look at that, on a hot dog. Oh, I'm getting a hit. Put him and hold him in the water, I'm getting a bite. Whew, action's hot. Oh no, I missed mine. I'm gonna get yours off the hook. That's a pretty big bullhead. That guy was pulling some drag. I'll say. Nice. He's croaking. I'm going to grab the hook and try to shake him off. He didn't even bite too hard. He just had it. There we go. Okay. Well, First catfish of the day for my grandpa. Not the second one. Yeah, second one. He had one before the camera was mm -hmm. happening. Oh. He'll be perfectly fine, don't worry. That's one of the bigger ones in this little hole. Okay. No. But I'm just gonna cast back in. I think I missed, that was on the, was that on the hot dog? Yep. Mm -hmm. So you guys, if you guys are throwing away some hot dogs, Use my them. grandpa's using them for bait and he got one, so. Okay guys, since my grandpa just hooked up on a hot dog, I'm gonna try a little piece of hot dog. Maybe that's the ticket today. Just 
just like that. Wrapped it on there a couple times. Hopefully I can get a catfish. Hey guys, I got a hit. Yep. That time. Nice. Got him. Okay. Got him on the hot dog. It's a little more average size in here. What they do with their fins, it's called uh, sturgulating, I think. And it's where they rub their fins together and make noise. A little bullhead. I'll get back to you guys in a second if this is a brown. I think this is a... I think this is a black bullhead, to be honest, but... I'm not sure, so I'll toss them back in. Finally got one. Okay, guys, I got a hit here. Got him. Good one, too. I'm taking him over to the bank. It's a nice, cat, nice catfish, too. Nice size bullhead right there. Just like that. Good one. I'm going to see if I can get my hook back. I don't know if I am. But it's a nice little bullhead. Nice. I thought he was a little bigger than he actually. I'm going to swim. Put my pliers and give him a little brush air. He's heavy. Mm -hmm. oh, there we go. Of course, he's not going to open his mouth. Get back to you guys when. Actually. Oh, that's way down there. Is it? Guys, I'm going to cut the hook because if I try to pull it out, he may die. Mm. Cutting the hook, cutting the line. Fish like this, catfish are super hardy. He's going to be perfectly fine. So, nothing's going to be wrong with him. Just I got to tie on a new hook, but. Grandpa got a small sunny on the worm. Perfect bait size, but we're not using him for bait today. So, hopefully we can catch a couple more catfish for you guys. He's just using a worm just like that. That works just as well. So I'm using the hot dog because I got a bite. But just because it weeds out some of the panfish. Wait, wait, wait. Might be getting hit. Bullfrog's going crazy. <laughs> I missed him. Okay, guys, so they bite with the uh, cup bait and the hot dogs. Dead. No catfish in the last 20 minutes. Um, I don't know what's up. This spot usually produces really good. I'm going to... Yeah, we're catching a ton. We've got a decent amount today, which isn't bad. But this time, just gonna go with the plain old garden worm. One thing I know, can't go wrong with it. No. Always catch them on the guard on the worms. So just putting it on, wrapping it a couple times, so. Sunfish don't bite me off. And cast in there. Sit back, relax. Hopefully one of these fish comes around. Get back to you when we get one. It hasn't been as good as it's, uh, we thought it would be, but um, still landing some fish. We got about, I think I got four catfish. There's a hit. There's a hit, guys. You got one? I got a hit, yep. Felt like a catfish thump, too. Oh, Pop, you got one. I got one. There we go. Nice, guys. Catfish too. Another small bullhead. Another small bullhead. On the night crawler.
I got it, I got it. There we go, guys. Making that little noise. Okay. Yep. Little catfish. Oh, oh, big hit, big hit, big hit. Catfish, nice. Perfect to finish off the day with. A final little bullhead. Hope you guys enjoyed. And he's saying goodbye. See you guys later. Peace.